Thank you, and welcome to Lang Manor. Please keep an eye out for our neighbors' driveways, as our ghosts have been working hard to create this year's show. And please turn off your headlights. Yes, I mean you. Tune in and enjoy the show, but don't get too scared, as our ghosts are friendly. Mostly, that is. <laughs> Thank you, and welcome to Manor. Please keep an eye out for our neighbors' driveways, as our ghosts have been working hard to create this year's show. And please turn off your headlights. Yes, I mean you. Tune in and enjoy the show. And please turn off your headlights. Yes, I mean you. Tune in and enjoy the show. But don't get too scared, as our ghosts are friendly. Mostly, that is. <laughs> Thank you, and welcome to show. Please keep an eye out for our neighbors' driveways, as our ghosts have been working hard to create this year's show. And please turn off your headlights. Yes, I mean you. Tune in and enjoy the show. But don't get too scared, as our ghosts are friendly. Mostly, that is. <laughs> Thank you for coming. A potion of magical things is brewing, so stay tuned for another ghostly show. Meet Uncle Rowan with an affinity for arson, whose days of lighting things on fire finally caught up to him. An argument between father and son led to a deadly duel between Lords Henry and Arthur. Little Johnny did not listen to his nanny, and unwisely tried to fly his kite during a tornado. Esther was buried beneath an avalanche of books when she tried to climb the library shelves to reach a forbidden novel. Agnes made such an effective cure for warts, she was henceforth burned as a witch. Beverly dressed as a mermaid to try to impress a local sailor and was drowned when the tide came in. <laughs> 